Shalom, everyone. I hope that you are doing fantastic. Thanks for joining for this combination reading. So um, whatever I wrote at the top, you know it before me. Uh, if you're returning, welcome back, guys. And those of you who are brand new, listen, my channel can be very intense. You could hear some really uh, heavy energy that could be very disturbing to you. I deal a lot with uh, the occult and... Um, uprooting nasty wicked type energies crime type energies and stuff like that and i'm connected with the uh Yehovah of elohim the maker of heaven and earth uh, i'm not church or religious okay but i am of uprightness and i love the uh um the spirit of truth that leads us and guides us and, and comforts us and and things like that now we're in the judgment we know that those of you who follow my channel you know it gets really intense here uh, but those of you who don't, I tell why I use the name of Jehovah, and there's a video down below, and I'll show you what his name looks like in the tarot. Uh, many people know that the tarot is made up of the living language, so if you didn't know that, then it's here. Uh, you know it now, but uh, just brace yourself, because it gets real intense sometimes on my channel, like I said, so you've been warned. If you stay, you stay. If you don't, you don't. So let's go ahead and connect with the great one, Jehovah. I just appreciate you so very much. I thank you for the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. You'll have a rebuke and bind and block every foul, demonic, wicked, dark energy right here, right now. And shove it down to the pit of hell where it belongs. What's going on? What, uh, what two elements do you want to look at here? So we got Gemini and... Um, where did it Gemini and Virgo? Give me just a second. Uh, that really shouldn't be in there. We have Aries and, um, I already did that one as well. Sagittarius was there. I've done several of these and you guys can find other combinations down below. Okay, that just came out again. Let's do, let's do Cancer and, because we only, I've only done one reading in Cancer and, uh, Aquarius is what I've done. So Cancer and we'll do Aries. We'll do Cancer and Aries energy so let me find a cancer card so that I can refer to it in the okay so cancer and Aries let's see what's going on with your energy here you have a what is the known information between cancer and Aries what is the known information so we have um, the nine of cups energy is here and this is a uh, wish fulfillment energy unless you're dealing with overindulging things some people obviously some people are so if you're new I hit the energy both ways uh, but this is beautiful energy something's known about uh, some type of wish fulfillment somewhere within something here um, we got people holding on so if this is narcissist energy than it is somebody's greedy here and somebody likes to be greedy in some type of situation then that's their wish fulfillment to be greedy like that and somebody's in witchcraft here because it's as a sin of witchcraft and there's overindulging energy or somebody's hanging on because some something's overindulging uh there's some type of securing something then with this uh four of pentacles um really try to hang on to something if somebody's able to secure something in a positive way, then that's a wish fulfillment. What else is known with Aries and Cancer energy? Well, obviously, there's a lot of energy coming out on yours. So there's a, a war going on, and I just did a big time Aries reading, and that thing was something else. Um, there is a war here. It's known about lots of money. That energy was really coming out on the Aries energy as well. Well, we got we got a lot of pentacles here. Um, we got somebody up in their head in their bed with anxiety that's known about, and the Queen of Pentacles is here within some type of situation. Wow. Uh, something about being generous is here or not. We got a lot of freaking fortune showing up here in this reading. So we got you know mothers and and bosses and um sisters and family people with the uh, empress oh, excuse me it's the lower version of the empress uh with the queen of pentacles somebody's in their head about something here there's a there's a lot of anxiety because there's a war showing here there so somebody died because this is inheritance and that's 
somebody's, you know, showing forth that if somebody lost a bunch of money because of something, and now they're they're having to hang on to something, and that's what's showing. But there's a, there's a narcissistic energy though around some of y'all's stuff that it's known about something overindulging within something physical or something with this queen of pentacles or that's you or whatever that is show me what's hidden what's hidden is uh death or the occult or something transformative obviously we got inheritance for some of you all is here somebody's got third parties with for some of y'all given what i've seen on that aries versus aries reading um we got secret sex going on here money property energies okay we got somebody the occult is here again stubbornness is essence of witchcraft you might as well just go ahead and get in the occult because you're sitting there somebody in your connection is um there's secrets here though there's a sea of people showing up here so there's a there's excess of something here within your situation so in the, in what's hidden is something real secret then there's some some type of a death that's also been hidden with your energy and somebody's not talked about some type of a death or let somebody know about something messages or children are here with this energy uh or teenagers somebody's tr somebody's trading secret money trading secret sex trading something with property trading something within the cult the occult uh trying to manifest something waiting for their ships to come in secretly and that's really here there's fbi secretly around the situation as well what else is in the hidden children are here the children really are here that page was just there and the, there's an oppression energy showing up in a lot of people's readings um that there's an open there's secret oppression but yet somebody knows somebody's up in their freaking head or they're mental or they're anxious all the time because there's secret death here somebody's dead or there's secret money involved in something okay it's that somebody stole something is the seven of swords can be found within the process of the nine of swords for some of you all there's been a war over that kind of stuff and a very physical war is also showing up here as well as somebody's gotten into a, a physical war somewhere and now sitting on some type of information because there's a secret death that's occurred then that's here if somebody knows about overindulging stuff here in your energy what's the outcome Jehovah? so again some of you all have fbi around the situation investigating something about children or somebody from your past is here if there's secret sex going on there's third parties and there's trading going on and somebody from your past or somebody from your high school possibly is here uh, or your parents could be here as well with the six of cups somebody just been in nostalgia in their mind and it's known about it Secretly, somebody wants to uh, make a decision to transform things as well. Come back around and forgive for some of you all. Show me outcome for Aries and Cancer energy. There's a conception here. There's a truth. There's communication. There's clarity here with the Ace of Swords. There's some type of truth here. There's a decision about a lover situation going on or that somebody's supposed to be in your life or something like that. That's an intimate relationship there. But there's a conception for some of you all. That could be the law as well. Any of the swords here. Uh, a message. Uh, th there's going to be some type of favorable testimony here with this energy. Um, this is a, this is also a lover card. This could also, so truth also about some type of um, uh, mischievous energy around something very passionate here, maybe with a teenager, maybe with a child, or just a lover in general. Um, or if you're going to court for something, again, that's a favorable testimony to something. Anything with the swords can go to law, okay? We have the FBI right there. Uh, the home. There will be a celebration for some of you all. That's positive. That's 11-11. That's a judgment also on some of your homes uh, right here. There, there's been there's been strife here, really bad. Okay. There's manipulation or the, there's a the strong family energy is here. Um, there's physicians. There's uh, communication with the um, magician card, but this somebody also needs clans of people. If this is going to be communication for a favorable testimony because somebody has manipulated something, then then 
then that's what that would go to for legal purposes. Um, but there's some type of uh, there's there's some type of manifestation energy here around whatever this is. There there will be a victory here. There will be a victory. There's actually six wands showing up here because the magician also has a wand at the bottom of his, uh, on his table. Oh my God, dear God, y'all. I've done several videos today. Show me energies for Aries and Cancer, please. A Sha'a is watching the destroyer who's trying to destroy you. And as soon as somebody's, try if somebody's trying to come around and be mischievous with the message or the strife, there's clarity about something because this manipulator is being watched. There's a victory that will be had within some type of situation here. Okay. Jehovah is showing that he's watching the destroyer. And once they try to do something manipulative, boom, they're going to get pounced on. This is their time for judgment, people. It just is. You don't have to fear them. There's secret. Uh, there's a true love energy here. Okay. There is some type of love here. That could be your family or something like that or somebody that you love. There's a rehab center showing up here. Well, we have a we have a doctor energy here as well. Somebody's went through some real hard time energy and they've got overindulging stuff going on. Then there's a rehab center. Somebody needs to go to rehab or something like that. Um, somebody's been dwelling in comfort in some type of uh, nice place and stuff like that. But if there's been some stupid stuff around it, then somebody stole some stuff. And uh, there's large sums of money and there's crappy, nasty stuff going on. So there's a manipulator here. Um, Chili is here. Or something at maybe Chili's restaurant or maybe you're from Chili. I'm not sure. Only you will know that. There's a Jezebel spirit here. Well, somebody's got a controlling freak energy here that is this is a queen that's known about this queen energy all right that's controlling and once that's that'll go back to pagan sacrifice it goes back to somebody's controlling their husband that's witchcraft stuff and everything else okay so some that we know what happens to jezebel she gets eaten in the end by the dog so if you're controlling stubborn it says so in witchcraft you're gonna get eaten your blood's gonna get uh licked up is what the scripture says somebody's been muzzled Okay, somebody's that had their mouth bound together, not being able to say anything. Okay, well, whatever that is for you. It's judgment day for these people. Show me energies for Aries and cancer or somebody's just not been talking because of some something that's been traded in what's been something is being traded here secretly with somebody from the past show me aries and uh cancer energy please Rain is here. Well, the death card can represent rain. It can represent a sea. It can represent, obviously, it's a mystery and stuff, but it's also the devil energy can take you back to rain. Or is it a record of some some kind? It might be a record because I just did a, a reading and um, we know about the record. But anyway, something could have happened in the rain for some of you all. That goes to the flood. Show me energies for Aries and um, <laughs> existing. Well, somebody died. Obviously, there's secret death here. Okay? And I, I guarantee that it's known about. This war is known about. The mental part of something is known about. Okay? The Jezebel spirit is known about. It's here. Holding on. Large sums of money is known about. Okay? Uh, so the all-consuming fire is coming out here. The end of the world is here. Okay, the teeth are here. Something's been sharp. There's wisdom. There's older people showing up here as well with the shin. And um, something's over. That's an ending to something with the world card. So the debt has been paid in full with some type of situation that's gone on. Well, obviously, something's here with money. Secret money. Show me energies for Cancer and Aries. Show 
Show me energies please, for an uh, Cancer and Aries. There is a letter, a document here, some type of a, a reward or something like that with the letter. Some kind of news or uh, so y'all go find out you're pregnant. That's a result of something. And we've got a, a, a physician here and a pregnancy here. We also have a celebration and a favorable testimony for some of y'all who are in the upright that's positive then. Um, for those of you in the upright, it's beautiful. But we've got some type of controlling energy for some of you all. Somebody's having to be watched in a very big way. The garden is here, and that's public things. The park, a concert, something like that is here. We have the snake. Well, there's the beast itself. That go back right to the rain, which also take you back to the goat god. Bapier. Oh, Bapier, you're going to burn. You're going to have a burning. Somebody's a liar. Somebody's a trick. Somebody's a deceiver. Somebody's a, a ditch. Okay? Somebody's in some type of secret sexual thing here. Doing something secretly. I, I hate to say this, but somebody also is molesting a child. Or did. Or something died within that. Or something transformed. Something happened here. Alright? And this here. This is secret sex. This is children. Or secret sex with somebody that you know. Or something with the parent is here with that energy. Okay? But anyway, or prostitution energy is here. And there's a lot of money around something. Some, somebody's in to sacrificing because the occult is here. And that's the snake. That's Cain himself. There's a lot of money here. There's a lot of excess things here. And obviously we have a recap center. And somebody needs a doctor. Because it's something that they've done. People, this is what come out for your reading. And those of you in the upright, there is a celebration here. There's clarity about something. And there's a favorable testimony if you're going to court. Somebody needs a doctor. And uh, some of y'all find that you're pregnant. If it's upright and you come out of something. If you got raped or something by some type of situation. Um, I don't want to tell you. I, I, I wish you well. I send you love and light. But somebody is getting. Somebody needs to sit down with their children. And talk to them. Or their teenager or something like that. Uh, where sex is concerned. Okay. Because there's something secret going on with y'all's energy. Because it's really coming out. Shalom.